Hello, this is Reverend Don Lewis coming to you from beautiful Florida. And today our question comes to us from a Nani Mouse. And a Nani Mouse has a question about the afterlife, and that question is predicated upon other vlogs in which we've discussed the idea that a person's experience of the afterlife will be colored by their expectations. And the question that a Nani Mouse has is, if a person were a Christian who believed that they were bound for hellfire, or a former Christian who had mentally renounced this idea but still held on to it emotionally, and this was their expectation at the time of their death, would it also be their experience? And my answer to this is, I don't know that a lot of people actually have that expectation, even within those religions, uh, but if you did, then I would say that perhaps that would be your initial impression. However, this would be in terms of not necessarily the reality of the situation, but your impression of it, your understanding of it. What happens would not be colored by the expectation, but rather your perception of the interaction. The afterlife is a place of peace and of healing. And that would be true no matter what your expectations are, no matter what your perception is. But you might perceive it in different ways based on those preconceived beliefs, uh, that would tend to color how exactly you experienced it, but would not change the nature of it. So regardless of what you're expecting to find, what you will find will be peace and healing, but how you perceive it may be different depending on those beliefs. The other thing that I was always taught is that in general, although you initially perceive things as you expect them, that perception will fall away quickly in terms of revealing what things actually are. So, even though you might come into it with a certain mindset for what you're going to find, what you actually find will be what is there. But again, your perception of it may be colored, but your experience of it really isn't so much. Your experience is still going to be one of peace and healing, but your perception of how you're experiencing it is what will be colored by your expectations. And if you are a diehard Christian who is sure you're going to hell, well, you know, you might have that imagery but you wouldn't really have that experience in the way that you were expecting. However, it would, I would think, perhaps color your initial perceptions of the afterlife. So those would be my thoughts on the subject. I hope you find them helpful, and until next time, may you blessed be. Hello, this is Reverend Don Lewis coming to you for Pagans Tonight Radio. Pagans Tonight Radio is an online radio network with different hosts and different shows seven nights a week. There's something for every taste, including Spanish language programming on Saturday evening. Check out pagansdenight.com today.